Uh, he did manage to take a game off of him. But let's see if uh, Twixie is able to adapt. All right, starting off with a handshake. Bringing us into old Ferrum Town. Yet another pretty stage, which I am biased for because there is a giant Grovile statue in the background and a little Trico on the clock. Oh, that's horrible. I know, I love it. All right. Twixie starting off with a laser. Both of them defending each other's attacks. Oh. The drop of the fireball is able to catch uh, Mutator just right. Okay, jumping over the laser. Doesn't uh, follow up with the thunder because unfortunately it's too slow to come out. Yep. Twixie pushing with minimize, nice. but punish on the grab. All right, 4Y, 8Y again. Follow up, able to bring us back in field phase. Throwing out the barrier for Azoki. Lots of pressure there. But Twixie has none of it, but forgets about the, the lightning. Oh, yeah, setting up frog for AP. Oh, and the Zen headbutt, able to take the round. Smart play there from Mutator. So I think that, uh... Round two. I think that... Oh, there's the lasers. I think Mutator is definitely just going to snip the frog because it is helping him out a lot. Yeah. All right, Twix able to keep just him off of the smog, but uh, Mutator declaring burst, putting on as much pressure as he can. That's going to be a lot of damage. Resetting. Thunder. Oh, able, to, nice. able to stop him before uh, the overheat able to come out. And he takes just the first game fast game one. Absolutely. He did not give Twixie any chance to breathe. Give this man some smart water. <laughs> All right, looks like we're going straight into the next match. All right, look. Now we are in Neo City, the daylight version. It's All right, let's see how this one's gonna go. I expect Twixie will start off with a Y button attack. Yeah, just kind there of we go, up. I'm technically correct. All right, using the Zen headbutt to approach. Uh, neither of them quite able to deal direct damage, but the Beyblade able to bring us into dual phase. Ooh, Stuffing smart laser, laser there. Stuffing him out. All right, we got the smog. Oh, and yeah, he catches him with the hex. Hurt. A lot of damage there, not quite enough to kill, but that still is a ton. And hits him on the shield and resets him into the hex. That's definitely, that would have been definitely. So it looks like a mutator call for a couple of uh, hexes. Yep. You gotta know once you're in that range, you gotta watch out for it. Yeah, Jump, that, that's, hit a button, anything. That's a big part of why I struggle in this matchup. I love the mid range, and so does Chandler. Oh, smart. Catching in the, the dash in with a grab. Grit. Declaring right, burst. Going burst. Good vortex. It's plus on block when it's charged up that much. Not plus on block there, but still hard. To, still basically impossible to punch directly. Nice shoulder. Check. Absolutely. All right. Mutator putting on a ton of pressure. Oh Catch him with the goodness. with the cross of thunder. That was beautiful. All right. Then headbutts in. Counter attack. Okay. Able to block the follow up laser bow and punches the JX. Mutator keeping himself on the board. You know, where he'd been the whole time. <laughs> yeah, now we're just waiting to see if... Uh, Twixie's able to take this uh, final round in this particular game. Couple of pokes into uh, burst. Yep. Teleports back, keeping himself uh, safe and alive. JX uh, in burst is wild, and I love it. Oh, my it. goodness. Oh, it doesn't get the follow-up, unfortunately. Oh, tried to punish, but unfortunately it gets caught by the uh, 6Y, I believe. All right, he's the Thunder. Counter Arm is able to get through. Oh, punishes blocking the barrier. Also, very interesting to know about Twixie's choice of support is that the, uh, the, the print buff allowed him to just overheat again. Exactly. It's very useful. You can't, it's very rare to see a chandelier that doesn't have some sort of self-buffing support. Just because there's no reason not to. All right, Mutator with the double debuff. One HP, trying to keep it in. Will he make this comeback? Okay, able to catch him with a counterattack. I mean, shut up, Mutator. This, this is a very 
very possible comeback. Yeah, the nature of Shadow Mewtwo is that you have to play him like you have one HP anyway, and so now he just has to now he just gets to play without fear. Oh, oh it gets caught by the laser after the teleport. Smart choice there from Twixie, bringing it one to one. For the full victory. The full victory. But it's definitely not impossible. Twixie's finding himself a bit and getting into. All right, we're bringing ourselves back to the Wii U days here on Ferrum Stadium. Can we reset? We're tired of seeing Ferrum Stadium. Oh, catching them just barely. The back wire. Mutator trying to play it safe. Oh, it gets the shield break. That's good. Fortunately, neither of them is quite able to follow up on anything there. Good JY there. Not able to follow up with the AY, unfortunately, as he was already falling by the time it hit. Ooh. All right. Full sequence here. Decides to reset. Ooh, smart overheat from Twixie. A lot of damage all at once. Okay, Mutator declaring burst, keeping itself out of the red health. Oh, that... Yeah. Bring us into a raw burst attack. And that is definitely dead. He is super yeah, dead. No. Just like this planet. I know, oh, he's getting properly freeze it here. Alright. Going on into round two of game three. Let's see how this goes. Oh yeah. Round two. Oh. Just go straight for his own laser. That's not a laser, but a yes. That's laser property. No. You can counter through it. Well, besides the count, yeah, the counter thing, but we can through everything. And uh, uh, except for level three flash game races, it, so it's not a laser. Oh, tries to catch him with the dash and grab, but unfortunately Twixie jumps right over it. Okay, tries to forward Y. CDC's through. CDC again. Oh. Getting caught with the laser. He has first, though. Okay, Twixie tries to be overheat, but it gets blocked. Mutator lands with the full vortex there. Tries to reset with the shoulder check. Not quite, not quite able to catch him though. Yeah, deploying burst, refreshing that shield, refreshing uh, phase shift points, and making sure he can just keep that 35 HP as long as possible. Okay, using the frog deer. Unfortunately, not able to follow up. Twixie was able to block, but lots of chip damage. Oh, but the... No, not holding the shield button, just slowly yep. backing up. Twixie, given, given the screen some finger guns. This is a very enemy to play. It's not much to watch. Yeah, I enjoy it. Okay, smart earthquake there from Mutator. Getting a strong start there. Shoulder check. Gets the 5A uh, combo. Ooh, gets punished by the slide. All right, Twixie now has that crit. And any damage he does is gonna be good. Oh. oh, unfortunately, he didn't charge the JX, so he wasn't able to punish the overheat. No, he didn't. And that is possibly punishable out of Twixie, Ooh, yep. except he got hit. Which means this is going to kill, once again. Yep, it is wrong. Which means Mutator is now up two to one. Hey, oh. Excellent work there. You can see the ears of the little bit adorable small ear. I honestly need to get that pair of headphones. They look really nice. Apparently, they're really good. This is not a sponsored thing, by the way. I don't even know what they're called. <laughs> you need to uh, either beat up Mutator and steal his headphones or politely ask him for the uh, name of the company. I found them on Amazon a long time ago. I just forgot the name. Here we are. This is game four. Starting off just a little bit of zone. Okay. Good Beyblade there, breaking through the counter armor. Starts with the JX. Smog. Now it's out of the barrier, so it's not going to be much use to Twixie. Not that it would be much use anyway with that full freaking face shift combo. Excellent work there from Mutator. All right, using the frog deer, able to prevent the full homing attack, which is very good for it. Oh, and he resets into the grab on landing. Smart choice there. I certainly didn't see it coming. 
Oh, but the Minimize able to get around the homing attack and the Electro Balls. Okay, declaring burst. Just doesn't want any uh, any sort of mix up from Twixie. Uses the flamethrower in order to keep some distance. Good barry there. Shoulder check. Zen headbutt. Okay, good. Doesn't do a follow up, so the overheat's not able to punch him, but the smog is able to get through the counter attack. Alright, this is where it's gonna hurt. Twixie even yep. like Oh, good shoulder check though. I was completely thinking that Twixie had this, but I guess not. So Mutator is on match Mutator is on match point now. Alrighty. Lots of shield pressure, able to get the shield break. Bring us into dual phase with very little damage actually taken. Mutator needs to figure out how to approach here now. Tries the thunder, but unfortunately the 6X is able to let uh, Twixie get past it. And, and teleports right into that laser. Absolutely. Okay, gets over the... Oh, wow, the trade, making sure neither of them face shifts. And no perfect today. Yep. Okay, good forward Y there. He's almost got burst, he just needs a little bit more, Vortex, but that Vortex is going to take it away. Vortex again. I, okay. I was hoping for a third one, I'll be honest. <laughs> well, uh, Chandler's people need it. Oh, and Twixie's able to take that. Vortex having lost uh, Mutator far too much health. Yep. But uh, Mutator has uh, burst already. Yep. And we do have to remember that right now, Mutator is on tournament points. If he wins this, he's, we're done. It's finished. All right, more Electro Balls, putting on a ton of pressure there. Setting up so much, getting it in for the forward wide. Okay, oh. okay, good. Stays patient, is able to block uh, the overheat. Good, oh, good use trade. of Frog here. All right, All right. Twixie has got to make the comeback from here. Possibly a guard break may help him a little. Yep, and okay, he, good. Oh, very, oh very good able to small. counter the earthquake. Oh, he jumps away from the hex. Smart choice there. Fully charged JX is able to punish that hard. The JYA wanted to follow up. Another barrier for the Oki pressure. Able to catch Twixie. Interesting. Okay, Zen headbutt not in follow, but he uses burst in order to prevent any punish. And he's just wanting any sort of pressure. He and he get, grabs and, and Mutator take oh. takes the entirety of Pokémon Tournament at Evo 2019. Usurping the champion from last year who has not really been at any events, but still proving that he's got it. Yeah, no, 